And today we are going to talk about the following subject, what is the difference between Alaskan Malamutes and Siberian Huskies? There is a lot of confusion in people's minds when it comes to this subject. We will give you all the details that you need to understand the difference between both breeds. Let's begin. Today we have two subjects, both pure breed. They look very much alike, but by paying close attention, you will notice big differences. The easiest way to differentiate them is by looking at their size, of course. But there are other more subtle details that I will show you. To begin, let's summarize both breeds' different functions. The Husky is a race dog able to run at a high speed for average to long distances. The Malamute is a dog able to run at a moderate speed and capable of pulling heavy weights. With the Husky's function in mind, he has more of an athletic look. His tail should not roll onto his back. All colors are admitted, and he can be blue-eyed, brown-eyed, or even odd-eyed. In general, a Husky weighs between 39 and 55 pounds. That's it for the Husky. As for the Malamute, his body is much more compact with a strong bone structure. His tail is attached higher than that of a Husky. As opposed to Huskies, a Malamute cannot be blue-eyed or odd-eyed. Brown and amber eyes are the only existing eye colors for the breed. The average weight for a Malamute ranges between 70 and 99 pounds. That's it for the Malamute. I hope that the explanations that I gave you will shed light on this question that comes up often. What is the difference between Siberian Huskies and Alaskan Malamutes? I have shown you two exceptional subjects, Safir, Canadian champion, and Marcello, Canadian champion as well. They are both sled dogs, but for two very different types of activities.